Rob Winger reporting live from the Stevens University Mustang Athletic Gala, joined by Stevens University women's lacrosse senior Olivia Montero. Olivia, welcome to the show. Thank you. Um, so you kind of traded in the jersey, stick, and goggles for the banquet dress here at the gala today, but your season isn't over yet. You guys just clinched the number two seed for the upcoming Matt Commonwealth playoffs. Uh, talk about what you're looking to accomplish. Um, we play Albright on Wednesday. Um, we're hoping to get the 4 o'clock uh, time slot because that's when we usually play. And we played them about a week and a half ago, and we played very, very, very well against, the, against them, and we were able to stop their attack with our um, disruptive defense. So we're hoping to achieve that and keep the attack moving and moving the ball and scoring, and hopefully that will get us a win. Well, you mentioned the disruptive defense, and they do a great job turning the ball over for you and getting it up front. Possession doesn't end until you're normally putting it in the back of the net. Um, you've done a great job putting the ball in the goal for your team this year. Uh, talk about what it means to you to be able to, you're the player who's looked to, to be putting the ball in the back of the net, and like I said, you do a great job. So what does it mean to have that role for this team? Oh, it's very stressful. Um, it's a lot of pressure on my back, but I know that no matter what happens, whether it's a goal or it's shot on the outside or a foul occurs or anything, that my team has my back. And any mistake that I make, I know that they're willing to fight for. And any mistake they make, I'm willing to fight for them. So I think this year we really have a team that plays together and plays for each other. And, and I think without that, I don't know if we would be as successful as we are this year. Now, the success you mentioned, it hasn't come easy for you. Um, when I was spending my time here, I saw you in the training room nonstop, and you've done a great job of getting yourself to a full slate of health so you can be out there um, competing on the field. It's an incredible show of determination and resiliency. What does it mean for you to be able to enjoy this senior season on the field as much as possible with all those teammates of yours? Uh, it means the world to me. I, coming back um, in January this season, I didn't know if I was actually even going to be able to play. And with all that stress on your back, you know, you get really nervous and you feel like you're letting these girls down. But to be able to fight for a, a treatment and, a, and a, something that will help me to be able to play and then be a, being able to play in every game and really fight hard for my team, it's an unbelievable experience. And while you've been a standout on the field with your teammates, you're also a standout in the classroom. Um, tell us what's next. What's the plans for after graduation? Um, I'll graduate and uh, hopefully take the NCLEX and pass the NCLEX um, and be a full-time RN. Um, I have a few different places that I'm looking to um, start working at, and we'll see which one I choose. Well, Olivia, you've been super successful on the field in the classroom. I'm sure the NCLEX will be nothing more than a double team that you've blown through already. Thank you for joining the show. Thank you. Rob Winger reporting live from the Stevens University Mustang Athletic Gala.